We're going to move right into hammer curls. It's hammer time. All right, squeeze your triceps, elbows at your side, straight up. Deep breath in, and then exhale. Deep breath in, and then exhale. Hi, Brian Seger here again, certified personal trainer and baby boomer fitness expert, where today I'm going to talk about the best workouts to do for men over the age of 50 and 60, and this one is going to be your arm workout. So this is the third and final exercise work, uh, routine in this series, and this workout should last you four to six weeks. Um, so Monday you did legs because it was extremely demanding. The Wednesday workout was your chest, shoulders, and uh, yeah, chest, shoulders, and back. And then this one is going to be your um, biceps and your tricep work. So um, these are the best exercises that are going to help you build that mass. Um, before beginning this workout, what I want you to do is give this a like, smash the like button, flex on that like button, so that way you can share this with other 15, 6 year olds so they can build their muscle. Thank you for that, by the way. Thank you so much, because I'm making this content for you guys. Taking my Saturday to do that for you. Um, the next thing I would like you to do is, if you haven't warmed up yet, you're gonna wanna do the warm up. So I create a video of all the best upper body warm ups that you can do. Go through those warm ups before you begin the exercises, because an exercise routine is no good to you if you get a strain, a tear, a pull, or an injury, because um, you can't train. Um, so here we go. We're going to start off with our first exercise, a close grip bench press. Great exercise for working your triceps. You can have your seat on uh, uh, the bench. You're going to lie back. It's going to be an, another great exercise to build upper body strength, something that declines as we, we begin to age. So the grip you want to use is just right outside shoulder width. So I'm going to grab right outside shoulder width here. You're going to press up. All right, you're going to lower on a count of three. One, two, three, boom, back up, one, one, two, three, one, up, ah, one, two, three, up, ah, boom. And you're gonna do 10 to 12 repetitions. Awesome. All right, you're gonna rest if you need rest. Um, next exercise we're gonna do, work in our biceps. You're gonna grab a barbell. What you're gonna do then is you're gonna contract your triceps first. You're gonna squeeze your triceps, stand it tall. You're gonna initiate the movement from your biceps. Up, deep breath in, and then exhale. Deep breath in, and then exhale. Good. Again, make sure you're emphasizing um, the tempo that you're doing the exercise. Make sure that you're using those because you need to keep the tension on the muscle because that's what's going to build it. Um, next thing is the intensity. Scale 1 to 10, pick a weight that is about a 7 to an 8. 1 easy, 10 it's really hard. Pick that 7 or an 8. All right, so those are the first two exercises. Do four rounds of that circuit, and let's go over here to the next group of exercises. All right, next exercise we're going to do is a lying tricep extension. Uh, as I said, it's going to be working on our triceps, lying tricep extension, and we're going to use dumbbells for this one. I'm a little thirsty. Grab a sip of water here quick. Do you know a fun fact? That you should have about six to eight ounces of water every 15 minutes of exercise. So just finish off my bottle here. All right. We're gonna do four rounds of this exercise. So what you're gonna do, grab hold of your dumbbells. You're gonna have a seat. You're gonna lie back and press up. Oh man, uh, I need some deodorant. All right. Uh, we're gonna go down under control and then back up. Deep breath in and then exhale. What you're gonna do is let your elbows flare out a little bit there. Deep breath in and exhale. Deep breath in. And exhale. Awesome. Boom. You're going to do 10 to 12 repetitions there. Um, and then you're going to move right into hammer curls. It's hammer time. All right. Squeeze your triceps. Elbows at your side. Straight up. Deep breath in. And then exhale. Deep breath in. And then exhale. All right. Lowering on a count of three on those. 
uh, 10 to 12 repetitions. You'll do uh, four rounds of this circuit and pick a weight that's about a seven or an eight. All right, let's finish off with our next group of exercises. I need to grab this little bar here. All right, got our, uh, we're gonna do some cable curls. All right. So what we're gonna do here, set up our cable. Your chest is gonna be tight, tight. Your chest is gonna be tall. You're gonna lean back slightly. You're gonna pull your core in tight. And then what you're gonna do is keep your wrist neutral. You're gonna curl up, count of one, and back down. And I need some WD-40, so if anybody out there has some, send them my way. There's Ace Hardware next door. I just need to walk next door. All right, just to save you guys, uh, I'm not gonna do all the reps there. But on the cable curls, I want you to do about uh, 20 rep. I want you to do 20, 15 to 20 reps uh, with that tempo. And then we're gonna finish off with some uh, rope press downs, 15 to 20 repetitions. So elbows at your side, and you're just gonna crank these guys out. <sighs> All right, you're gonna do two, three rounds of that circuit. I wanna uh, say I appreciate every single one of you guys. Thank you so much for going through this whole series. And I know there's a few of you that have emailed me early on from this series who've been putting that in the work and asking me questions. Uh, I wanna say I thank you guys too because you inspire me. Every time I get those questions, I get inspired to be more for you guys and to make these videos. And that's the most exciting part about this. If you want help like others, um, I'd be happy to work with you. There's a breakthrough uh, session link down below. Just click on that, fill out the application. I'll hop on a call with you and I can see how I can help you on this fitness journey. You guys have a great day. Let's keep building muscle. Let's keep being there for our families. Let's keep being there for our communities. And uh, let's keep living the best dang 50s, 60s, and 70s and beyond in our life. Have a great day.